Hi, my name is Lena McCullough. I am almost 47 years old. I will be in a few weeks here. And I came down, and I do say came down, not diagnosed with young onset Parkinson's disease when I was 41. Um, I use the term came down with instead of uh, diagnosed with because I actually had sudden onset Parkinson's disease. I was completely fine in the morning. I had had no symptoms before in my life of Parkinson's disease. And over a half hour drive home, I developed full on Parkinson's symptoms on the left side of my body. Um, those progressed and got worse and eventually I started levodopa. Um, I am weird in that I got dyskinesis from my levodopa at only 300 milligrams a day. Um, I tried going up a little bit higher to 450. At that point my dyskinesis turned into myoclonic um, convulsive like symptoms and my whole left side would go into almost convulsions um, when my meds were going up and when my meds were going down. So at that point this was about three and a half years into onset, I became housebound. Um, I couldn't walk when I was on meds because I got so, such bad dystonia in my legs. Um, I was having convulsive leg tremors six hours a day and um, I couldn't work anymore and I had to quit work. At that point I learned about um, focused ultrasound in Switzerland, uh, polydiothalmic tracheotomy. I talked to a couple people that had had the procedure and decided it was the right approach for me. And in April of last year, I went for surgery on the right side of my brain. The left side of my body is now 80% symptom free. And I hope to go back this year sometime for surgery on my other side of my body, which has developed more tremor as time goes on. I can show you my hands. This is my left hand, which was treated. 90% of the tremor is gone. I couldn't spread my fingers at all before surgery, couldn't really use this hand at all. I've got about 80% function back in that hand. I now actually have more tremor in my untreated side than I do on my treated side, even though my left side was initially way worse than my right. Um, I know it's not an option for anyone, everyone out there. It's expensive. You have to travel to another country, but for me it was life-saving. It got me back to work. It got me back to being able to drive and cook. I still have some dystonia in my right foot when I walk, so I'm not able to walk long distances, but I have no problem going to the store. Um, I gained 25 pounds after surgery. Before that, my tremor was so severe, I could not keep weight on at all. And right now, my meds have worn off, and you can see I don't have a lot of symptoms, even with my meds worn off. Um, the biggest issue is tremor in my right leg that has issues when I drive and when I walk. And so that's why I'm hoping to have side two treated this year. So that's my short story. I'm just super thankful for having had this procedure and for it giving me my life back.